sitting right beside you, all right? Now, suppose you don't know much about robbing caravans. Not much, I guess. <laughs> no. Well, nor do I. But I know a thing or two about protecting them. And if a robber sees some strong men sitting up front, two of them guns for hire, then they're gonna wait for the next set of fools to come on through. Unless they take the guns to mean they're carrying something valuable. Instead of pre-cut timber and some tools. What? No. Wait. Look, trust me on this. You are overthinking it. You hire a gun, you hire peace of mind and a deterrence. So I'll sit here looking big and scary, and you can concentrate on the horses. All right. I'll do just that. Maybe I've done this kind of thing before, and maybe I can handle a weapon. But I'm not so different from you, partner. I think you might be. People wonder how you can handle it, living by your gun. But it's the same as any other occupation, really. Hey! We're taking the next right up towards Manzanita Post. Now, where were you? When I get home, I put my gun on the rack and it stays there. I mean it, it, it really stays there. I don't even think about it. My mind's on my wife and the little ones. I'm chopping wood, mending the roof, putting the kids to bed. But when I'm out here, I'm watching the tree line. I got my gun at the ready. And I'm trying to make my employer as comfortable as possible. That's, uh, real good of you. You're in good hands. I know this country well. Good. Am I finally gonna meet this tool maker? Viking blood. Fellas up there used to worship a god with a hammer. Guess I figures they'd still be making them. I'm not sure how much English he speaks, but Neil's knows too. This is the spot. Just up ahead. Okay. You boys wait here. After you, Mr. Milton. Like I said, Nils is a, an acquired taste. Let me do the talking. Uh, there he is, working away. <laughs> Nils. Nils, it's me. Willard Wayne. Okay. This is my associate, Jim Milton. Okay. He heard you was the best, best smith around. He needs some tools. He's building a ranch house up at Beecher's Hope. Beecher's Hope? Okay. Have you got any made? Uh, okay. Like I said, an acquired taste, but a heart of gold, and he's the best. You off someplace, Nils. Okay. So Milton is uh, working with Cakes Hardwood and Timber in town. Should I get them to pay you and add it to his bill up there? Okay. Come on, let's get moving. Whew. Okay. <laughs> All right then, Beecher's Hope. They've been trying to sell that property for some time, haven't they? Took a look at it myself as it so happens. Seemed like a lot of work. Too much for me. But more power to you. Must have seen something in it I couldn't.
Find some cover! Devin, you okay? Yes. Is that the last of them? I think so. There's more! They got the tools! They grabbed Mr. Wayne! All right, you stay here, guard the wagons. Charles, come on!
it! They're on top of us! He's coming! Oh, I don't like the sound of that! Come on! Got more? We gotta clear these fellas! Go to work! Let's keep moving. We gotta be gaining on them. I hope so. They're like ghosts. Please, God, no. Ah, damn them. Hold on, Mr. White. I found the tools. Now, where's Mr. F All right. Shit. Jesus. We gotta move fast. Come on. Ago, he was chewing my ear off. He knew what he was getting into. Did he? Skinner. Everyone knows. Except me. Later, John. <laughs> <laughs> 